come together in community, then we can choose to say no to what they have in mind. They won't be able to force us if there's enough of us that can come together and say, look, we want a more fair system and we want to have a say. We want to have choices. If they just, if they remain in power and nobody stands up and everything goes digital, then that means having real money outside of the system is the only way that you're ever going to be able to protect it protect your purchasing power and protect your wealth because digitally they can do anything they want. That's programmable money. Yeah. And if you have no alternative, you have no alternative. So now they remain in power and they're able to really do not nice things and you have, and you have no choice. I have hope because more and more people are waking up and yes, it requires the public to have confidence in these ruling bodies. And that confidence has been really waning for a number of years. And there certainly could be something that just makes them lose confidence. Um, no, it's actually the central bankers that are going to revalue the currency against gold. And it'll be based on how much money is out there and how much of that money that's out there they want to cover, hence the cover ratio. And that's the unknowable, right? Until they actually do that. You know, frequently, I think on average, the, the most normal ratio is a thousand to one. Could that be true this time? Sure. Could it be more? Sure. I mean, could it be less? Sure. I mean, I don't know what that cover ratio is going to be, but uh, yeah, it's the central banks and it's based on the money that they got to cover and reset and revalue. Oh, you should be very concerned. But what that means, and we're kind of experiencing it right now where you have <laughs> prices going up rapidly and you have growth that's declining rapidly. And we already are. So you may have heard the term stag inflation. Uh, and I'm hearing that and seeing that more and more because that's exactly where we are right now. We've got slowing growth and we've got greater inflation. So a hyperinflationary depression would be that, but on steroids. Even though you think that you're looking to be able to buy food and rent during a reset crash, there's a lot more to it. Having said that, you know, it depends on how much you have to work with because frankly, you need both. And I've done enough studies for how both gold and silver behave during that. Maybe we should pull and that which out one and does better? that. And it's always gold that does better because that's what they reset the currency against. And there are, you don't have to buy a full ounce. There are, you know, um, sovereigns or early Swiss francs fractional or gold. fractional gold coins, yeah. fractional gold, and then silver, because you really need both. You really do. I know a lot of people go, well, I'm stacking silver, and but I have both, and I have more gold than I do silver. But the gold will ensure you're able to pay your rent, and the silver will be able, will ensure that you can buy your food, but you also might want to think about growing some food. Gold held in your home runs no political risk. So um, I'm not saying that they can't uh, confiscate. I do not know whether or not they will. So personally, I like the kind of gold that is least likely to be confiscated. But I can tell you that if you don't own physical gold and silver out of the system, you have no chance. You know, well, I hear about deflation. I hear about inflation. Which one is it? And my response is always, it's just the opposite side of the same coin. So it actually doesn't really matter whether you're dealing with, with deflation or inflation, but there is only one way to, to deal with or fight deflation or a depression. And that is with inflation. And the only difference between inflation and hyperinflation is the speed of the inflation. So uh, why should you be concerned? Because it's going to impact absolutely everybody. And if you're not prepared, then then you're going to be in deep doo-doo. I mean, you know, you've gotten on average 80% of the population that ends up in um, abject poverty. Do you want to be part of that 80%? Because that's how it could impact you if you are not prepared for this. It's time to cover, cover your, your Assets. We use the wealth shield and the foundation of the wealth shield is real money that runs no counterparty risk and is virtually, you have it in your possession, but for all intents and purposes for everybody else, it's invisible. And it holds its purchasing power intact as they hyperinflate all of that debt away, including all of the money.
Uh, this is really, it's such a big con game. And when that confidence is lost, it's hard to get back. And if people do not have confidence <laughs> in the powers that be, they will not have confidence in the money and they won't use it. I mean, goodness, when you stop and look at even, I mean, this, we could not be living in more interesting times, but look at what's going on in China around their CBDC, right? They brought it out. I mean, I have this whole thing, which you guys will be seeing soon. So first they're going to work with Alipay. They're going to work with all of these private digital currencies that are out there. Mm -hmm. So they say, right now there's a big battle brewing because no government and, and I don't know who's going to win this, whether it's going to be the, the private cryptos or the CBDCs. So again, you could go back to, well, that's been ingrained for, you know, well, it hasn't been 200 years, so the Fed's been around since 1913. But, you know, more than 100 years, people don't even remember when we were on a good money standard. Yeah. And yet, you know, when the CBDCs, and they tested it, China's further along than anybody else is on it, and they were still having, and they were giving this money away, and they were still having trouble with adoption. And so that didn't work, so now they've got to go attack you know, private cryptos because they figured they could just slip that in. I don't know. I, I'm not prepared to say one way or the other who's going to win this battle. You know, I will never forget. And I, I don't think that it really made a big statement to me at the time because I was 10 years old when, when we were in my uncle's back bedroom and he showed my parents and me because I was there these two safes full of gold when it was illegal to hold five ounces, more than five ounces. And, you know, it wasn't until, I mean, it's many years now, but I was sitting there and I was writing. And I remember I said, if you were alive like I was in 1971, and then all of a sudden that image came up in my mind and went, oh my goodness, you know? Collectible so, gold. Collectible gold, period. Because all that gold was 33. And then... Loophole. Loophole, exactly. And then you're holding the kind of gold that you can use, not black market, in the normal marketplace, which is what I personally want to do. Before we continue, help us clicking that YouTube like button and subscribe now to our channel. This shows the algorithm that you valued this information. And it helps us spread that message. Sharing is caring. And now, let's continue. What to do in such a situation? Inform yourself and keep your financial education strong. We from the Compact Group offer our loyal subscribers a free educational portal with first-hand monetary, financial, and economic knowledge. Enter our invite-only Insider Club by clicking the link below. You will get access to first-class information far earlier than the rest. We have prepared a special deal for all our members where you can access a giant pool of Robert Kiyosaki's financial wisdom for just $1. To find out more, simply click the link below and join our Insider Club absolutely free. But there is more you can and should do. Build up several streams of income. More and more people realize that they have to take their future in their own hands but they don't know how and where to start. We from Compact offer our Insider Club members unique opportunities. Strengthen your financial muscle and get the edge. Click the link below. Become part of our free Insider Club. No financial obligations. But there's one important thing you have to know. You have to become active. So do it now. Become active and see you on the other side.